So, if you guys have seen Time Rock 2, this is where it gets confusing. So, you return to the camp just to find out that the camp owner, sorry, uh, one of the camp owner's like, ex partner, opened up a camp right across from. Across the lake from where you are, and that you said like they have AC, all the nicest properties, and everything else. Um, when here is a few things that is like so wrong with this movie. First one is that so they went to attend. That Campstar invited them over to uh, as a welcome because they just opened. It's a nice gesture, like okay. And one of the daughter, like daughter of Exo, like was like there. And so they performed for Camp Rock, and she's like, way at the back of the stage and Mick Jonas is sitting maybe the fifth or sixth row from the stage so it's quite a distance from the stage to the from where he's sitting to the stage but she managed to fling her like hands so hard that her bracelet can fly across the stage and it doesn't hit any random person it hits him like, straight on the eye like how is that possible and the nearest person to hit is maybe like the bleachers near to where she is but it goes diagonally across to the other end of the stage which makes no sense and again, the other one is wrong is that uh, so if you like your campus from your camp go to the rival camp, don't you have to tell your parents first because like a lot of them are under eighteen. So why are you gonna tell the parents? Oh sorry, uh, we no longer have your daughter. Isn't that illegal? And then the third thing is that why do you go and compete with the other the newly opened camp to say that you're better than them? If you're better than them, you don't need to prove it. Then the worst is that they lost, and all the campus decided to come back anyways. Then what? You know? What's that? Oh. Hi, we saw the fire. We really don't get to do this kind of thing. So we were hoping there was room for some of us to join. There's always 